What's going on, Davinites? Welcome to Dav Ranch. Today, um, of course, you can see my Vita, so I'm going to show y'all why it's awesome to have a Vita. Let's go ahead and start this up. Hopefully, we don't hear any of my animals. Um, so, first up, one of the big attractions to this thing is let me go ahead and crank up the volume a little bit so y'all know. You see Grand Theft Auto. Vice City 3 San Andreas. So, me being the awesome person I am, I'm going to show. Okay. So, there we go. Okay, we hit the start game. Um... Of course, you can start a brand new one. Me, I could have started... I could have loaded my game so yeah and what I'm using is a Hori grip on my one on my 2000 which is that's the model I recommend using so I'll show some gameplay of that that looks pretty freaking awesome sorry doo, 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 doo. the cheats do work actually it's pretty they use the PS2 cheats so oh. I suck at this because I'm driving, I'm playing this through little camera lens. Yeah. Whoops. So that's how that one looks. I'm a pretty crappy driver right now because I'm not really even paying attention. I'm just driving around showing y'all. So that's one of the big things of that. I'm going to bail out of that. Okay. Take you to the next feature. GTA Vice City. Come on. All right. This is my favorite. I love Vice City. Vice City is my all-time favorite. So I'm just going to load my file. You can start it from this, but I like to show a little bit of gameplay because this is kind of the big attraction or the main attraction to this of why. This is what brings the Vita up on for me over any other handheld console. Come on. Money. The GTA 3 codes work on this one instead of... Yeah, I know it's kind of weird, but... Okay, I got nothing in my garage. Okay. Thing is, you gotta use... Okay. Uh, you go back up there. There you go. Run around. I'm looking for a car. Or a motorcycle or something. Go up there, you can get the secret packages. Run over there. This one you can't very well swim in. Hey, there's a car I want. I'm probably going to steal it right in front of a cop. Right in front of Nope. The music is good. And of course, I'm actually playing this through the camera, so. Good old 80s music. Okay. So there's one of the main attractions right there. Okay, I'm bail out of that. Um, aside from that, I'll show GTA. Um, San Andreas as well. And then I'll get on to the, the juicy stuff. Like uh, PKGJ. I'm just going to resume where I left off. I'm aware my music just cut off a little bit on it. Now, voila! Now here's a cool thing, if you want to add the cheats, you can actually hit, I'm going to move out a little bit, select, L and select, and boom, you can input the cheat code, which is pretty much your PC code. And then of course I'm going to run around, I'm going to ignore them, I'm going to blow this call, or I'm going to answer the call. 
Oh, shut up. I want to hear you, Samuel L. Jackson. Uh, okay, so we'll go back in. Do, do, do. Now I got a shovel. Go up there and I'll show some. Well, El Camino, so let's go find it. Unless you watch Dav Ranch, uh, I mean, uh, Demolition Ranch. You can't get an El Cromino. <laughs> So that's pretty cool. Now, aside from that, we have the good, the juicy stuff. Okay, so we'll go get your PS Vita games. I mean, mine is set up in such a way. You get your Vita homebrew shop, which is pretty awesome. Let's see. Takes a little bit to uh, load on the homebrew store. There you go. Max Payne. Tab over. Get all your other stuff. I haven't caught an update since 2020. Um, the 64 emulator really doesn't work that well. Okay, so there's that. So now. I got all my emulators and stuff like that. I'll show the retro arts. This is how. This is pretty cool. And. Mine is taking a little bit of time to load. Okay. So, mine looks pretty cool. Me, I've got. Name. I'll run a. I've got a few playlists made. Let's see. Um, let's go ahead and grab Game Boy Advanced. Eh, what's a good one? Oh yeah, uh, Metroid. Any of the Metroids were good on this. Okay. I am winging it because I'm looking through a puny ass screen. Puny! Metal... Do your playlist select um, if you want to. If you want me to, I'll put a video out on how to do this. It's pretty straightforward. All right, uh, Metroid Zero Mission. It's one without the, with the shortest. And since I've already got my core pre-selected, come on. There you go, it took a little bit of time. I'm using a slow emulator. Because I'm probably... This is probably the one with cheats, that's why it sounds so choppy. Certain emulators will not let you use cheats. Yeah, um, this will probably be shown... I'm probably... I was probably trying to use cheats. But overall, when you get your Vita, it is, uh, and you get it modded and everything, man, that it is a work of art. Yeah, this is. I'm I'm using one where you can use you can enable cheats. So my buttons that I've selected, so I can go to select the cheats. I always go to load certain ones. Okay, let's see. Uh, game Boy. So, let's see. Metroid. Uh, this is going to be a long video. Oh, well. Sorry, y'all. This is going to be a long video. Metroid Zero Mission. And... I think we have everything on right now. M must be on. Uh, I'm f I think that's it. Infinite super missiles. Go back.
because I enabled the cheats. Look how broken the game is. Okay, now I'm going to back out of that because that's the only reason why it's choppy is because I was using a, uh, a different emulator or a different core. There, that's better. Uh, X to close. When you close it, it takes you to the black screen. Not all... All right, there you go. All right, so... Pardon me, mine... Am I moving faster than that? You can go up there and select games, Virtual Boy, stuff like that. Hit home to go back. Um, all right. I've got homebrew games like Star Trek and stuff like that. Um, let's go show uh, Adrenaline. So Adrenaline is the next thing that's pretty awesome. I'm using the latest one. So, come on. Oh, that's beautiful. You can put it in whatever ink. I put mine in English because I'm just going to say Tokyo and crap like that. Because this is the initial. And because my, my Vita is Japanese, I, I'm stuck with using Circle. So you can flip through. Here, we'll fire up Mortal Kombat PSP. You can use um, the bubble. You can have all this stuff on your front of your screen with the bubble maker, the adrenaline bubble maker. Me, I'm too lazy to do it on this memory card. Or I'll get to it later on. But I'm, I was out of having a blast playing uh, Grand Theft Auto. So, all right, I'll just show a quick. Yeah. Let's see if we can get this video done before my battery dies. <laughs> Come on. I'm going to be button mashing just to give you a heads up. How oh, beautiful that works. There you go. You back out like that. Or you can just hit home. Bail out. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Me, I've got everything on here. Come on. The only thing that sucks is that you have to format all the videos in MP4 if you want to watch movies on this thing, which is pretty awesome too. It's a movie player. Uh, okay, let's grab a... Let's grab one of my favorites. Siphon Filter 2. That's my favorite PlayStation game. It was what I grew up with that my brother always hated. He's like, oh, I hate that effing game. To, um, I'm like, yeah, well, screw you. <laughs> he was more of an, an RPG fan. But I will say Final Fantasy IX was my favorite. And the cool thing is you can actually use the CW Cheat plugin with this. And that sounds beautiful. Okay, I'll show a little gameplay on that. I'll go to my loaded file or whatever. I have a 1000 as well that pretty, that performs pretty darn well as well. I had this as my ringtone for a little bit. Love that. I love that theme. Uh, I think I'm. The music on this is... There's how loud. That's loud. I just cranked it up just for the hell of it. Man, look at that dude. He just... 
these guys. So that's how that runs. Okay, let me bail out of here. You double click, you hit home twice on mine to go back. And now I'll show you a Vita game. Me, I, I've got a lot of Vita games. So we'll go with, uh, where's Ninja Gaiden? I've got them all scattered, scattered out. They're all over the place on this one. I'll have to find them. There it is. I was looking. Ninja Gaiden. And one of actually, this is my favorite um, Vita game. If I had a legitimate Vita, I'd still and I can access. Yeah, I'd, who cares? Well, I haven't started that. I'm just putting it on random difficulty because I'm not even going to save it. Damn, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah, you can it. There you go. Okay, so that's that. Now, there's also um, your settings, package install, crap like that. Uh, where's a good one? Oh, yeah, your PKGI or PKGJ. This is one of the big things that I did want to show. Sorry it took me so long, but I was just showing you. You can, it's your free shop. You got your, well, I'll go zoom in a little bit. Uh, show games, DLC, demos, themes. You got the theme shop for that. You can get your PS1, PSP games. Yeah, PSX games. Yeah, you can get everything from there. Okay. Um, and then where's the, uh, you got your theme downloader. Come in here. I just want to, I'll just grab that just for the hell of it because it'll look kind of cool. And then cross to download that. Download it. Okay. Guess it took, I don't know. It'll get on there. Actually, yeah, you have to go to the... And then you go to your themes. And voila, blue and red. It's actually a pretty cool theme. So, you've got a lot. I think I even have um, Devolution. I've got a bunch of stuff on here. Auto Plugins 2 is your best friend. On here, it helps you set up everything. Vita Plugins, install, all that. Bail out of that. Um, what other stuff? I You can turn on the music. You can Enzo, Shark Food. What's this one? Oh, Hex Launcher. Oh, yeah, here's a cool one. Here's a cool little app. I just picked that up just for the hell of it, because... Yeah. Just shows all the for the box cover of all your Vita games. Stuff like that. So... Um, have I covered everything? Oh, yeah, why not? I'll show you the N64 emulator. Why not? So, this is the N64 emulator. I only have a couple of games because I'm just I only. Like, I'll download all your compatible stuff. Me, I'll just look over. I have Ocarina of Time. It'll tell you game that can be played from start to end with playable performance. So I'll just boot this one up for you, and it's launching it. Okay. Actually, had pretty good sound.
There you go, you can start to hear it's kind of choppy. This actually plays pretty good on this one. Too bad you can't see the screen, that means it's a messed up version, but... That works. So, you know, that's one of the benefits to having a PS Vita. It's pretty awesome, if I do say so myself. You would, you can find, um, find uh, the Vitas on eBay. Um, I bought mine from a Japanese seller who t actually took really good care of it. I'm going to take it out of the shell just to show you. And in... And I'll ask you, I took good care of it myself, too. Nice, clean. I, I like all white systems, so... Yeah. If you would, please do hit that like, punch that subscribe, comment down below. Um, if you want to see more v Vita videos... Uh, that's a tongue twister. Try and say that five times. Um, <laughs> other than that, y'all... Tom Dab, signing off for Dab Ranch.